Today's program was made possible by a generous grant from the Cortland Foundation in the Northern Piedmont Community Foundation to launch our first ever band music mentor program at Liberty High School. We uh, have a very active band program here uh, containing a, a wind ensemble, a symphonic band, a marching band, a, a pep band that plays during the basketball season, and a jazz ensemble. Well, this was a, a, a very, very fine group of, of young students. Uh, they were very, very receptive. Uh, the band director here is doing wonderful work. The students were very well behaved and very responsive to um, all the things that we did. The clinic today was extremely exciting. Uh, I feel happy for the students. I feel like they learned more in the hour and a half that the clinic was going on uh, than they could have uh, in weeks of rehearsal time. What the program aims to do is to model and demonstrate to students by bringing in professionals to sit within their ensembles. And through this process, they get the opportunity to hear how someone with more experience may approach the music and then work that into their own approach as a student. We had 15 uh, pros sitting with the students. They demonstrate correct uh, playing techniques and have the students play along with them. And uh, because of that, uh, the wonderful ability of the ear to imitate, uh, a lot of startling progress was made. The clinic today was uh, an incredible opportunity for the kids to, to really hear you know, what professional musicians uh, you know, sound like and how they play and, and, and just how they approach their instrument. If you provide a professional example for you know, students, you know, they'll follow that and, and they're, they're quite quick to pick up on it. So one of the challenges that we have as band directors is we're constantly working with the overarching ensemble. But one of the best parts about this clinic was that we had individuals coming in who, who specialized on these instruments for the students and were able to sit down and give them very specific technical feedback that we might not catch during a, a normal rehearsal. I think Programs like this are really, really important. Uh, you know, we live in a, in a fairly rural county. Uh, if you take a look at our outlying counties, you know, they have many different resources that, that they have in their backyard they can take advantage of. And, and we don't necessarily have those resources. Uh, the, the mentor program here brings those resources right to the school and, you know, students can benefit from, you know, individuals that we don't have in the community. This um, mentoring program is really a partnership with the Piedmont Symphony Orchestra here in, uh, in uh, Warrington, Virginia, and with the Capital Wind Symphony. And um, we do them, this was a, a band program for a, a band for wind instruments and percussion, and uh, they're also being done for orchestras in the other schools by Glenn Quater. So we're very excited about this uh, partnership and hope to, uh, to uh, continue this over a number of years. The conductor of both George uh, and uh, Glenn were fantastic. Uh, you can tell that they both really care about the students overall. They're concerned about music in our schools and, uh, and, and promoting it and making sure that it survives and flourishes. Uh, so uh, I, I really think that uh, getting, giving them more opportunities to come out and work with our students uh, is just the best thing possible. Looking forward to the future, I hope the PSO uh, mentor program becomes a staple here at Liberty High School. The enthusiasm from uh, you know, administration and the other directors here at Liberty uh, and just seeing the kids being inspired and, and want to do better, uh, you know, it, it was just an amazing experience to see that with our students today. I want to do something with music, hopefully after high school and college and stuff. and. It was just kind of inspiring to see other people who were already doing it and succeeding with it. It'll make me want to work harder to get it. I never had a thought in my mind that I'd be playing saxophone past high school, but today's program really made me think about taking music to a professional level. I really hope this gets to come to Fauquier County again, and I hope as many kids get the opportunity that, that I had um, and everybody in this room had. Um, because I, I feel like it, it's something that, need, that needs to be in every band program.